Welcome to my store. Okay, we're not really too sure what they think they're doing, but if you ever wondered what starfish looked like from the bottom with all their feet and everything, uh, here's a prime example. So I guess he's moving from one to the other, because that's on the overflow, so, uh, I don't know. So we just threw a mussel in there, and of course you can see the hermit crabs are running for it. That starfish, I put him on top of a mussel, and that starfish is on top of another mussel, okay, because, uh, they can't quite get to it fast enough before the hermit crabs do, so uh, you give them a bit of help. That starfish, I don't know if he realizes the muscles there or not, because I kind of set it on when he was uh, up on the side, and then it fell down when he let it go, and now he's heading down. Let's see how he has the legs, they're glued on, and then they put the releaser on, and... Uh, you can see how he slowly lets one go and fastens another one and lets the next one go and fastens another one. So if you ever want to take a starfish off, what you do is you just vibrate them. So you don't want to force him because if you force him, he'll rip those two legs off and then he has to regrow them. You just gently tap them, 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 tap, 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 tap. If you're irritating enough for long enough, you can get them to come off. But you want to give him time to let go. That way you don't leave any feet behind. You can tell it's getting loose because he wiggles more and more and more and more with every movement. That guy there is trying to reach for the other uh, rock. See, so they don't really have eyes, but they do have light sensing organs. Okay. See how we got that guy off? We didn't leave any feet behind or anything. So we'll put him down there upside down because I did promise that I'd let you guys see uh, what a starfish looks like while he's turning over. He's got his feet out. He's not really doing anything yet. Hermit crabs are, of course, running around. Those are the dwarf zebra hermit crabs from Hawaii. Then we got the... There's one elegant hermit crab there. You can see how he's got the uh, orange knees and blue uh, eye stalks. And there's another one down there. Those are Hawaiian as well. Okay. You can see how the starfish has that one leg right there at the end kind of half turned under. Okay, that's the start that he's going to be turning. So he'll gradually, slowly, right now we're at three and a half minutes, no, four minutes right now. And uh, they don't move quick, they don't do anything quick. See how he's got that hermit crab? That hermit crab there, he has his foot on his shell. Okay, the hermit crab let go. Uh, he let go of the hermit crab so the hermit crab could get away. But if you can see, he's got that one arm twisted around uh, underneath him pretty far. So, uh, yeah, now he's moving quicker. There's the flame angel. We got a marine beta that does something that most don't. 
He doesn't hide. Mind you, he's been in three different tanks over the last ten years. Okay, now he's making some major progress. You see how he's just levering himself up and he's got the other arm around and he's flipping himself over. He's got his feet out ready to grab anything. And there he goes. So that's how a starfish turns over. He took a couple minutes to do that. But other than that, he did very well. And that other starfish, he's coming down the wall. And none of them are getting that. So now that he's down there, I'm going to take the mussel shell. And what I do to make it easy for him, I just put it there. And then I set him on top of it. This guy here, if you look in there, right at the end of my finger, you'll see pieces of shrimp. And he's, I think he's sucking them into him. Like, he eats through his, uh, these slots is where his belly comes out. And he puts it around the food and digests it that way. And we'll move that rock. Um, I'll shake the uh, hermit crabs off that muscle. So right there where his foot can find it. See how fast he gets on top of that. Yeah, well, the hermit crabs are going to come back pretty fast too. I'm not sure if he'd win in a fight. Probably the hermit crabs, they're stronger and they got that seashell to protect themselves. Okay, he's coming down over top of it. Well, the hermit crab might try to pull it away from him. So yeah, that's how a starfish looks underneath. It's how a starfish turns upside right. And uh, it's all about starfish. So we got these from uh, Dominican, so they've been here a month and a half. Okay? Bye.